Hello guys, today I will answer a very definite question. Are you overweight? If you go to any doctor, they will advise you to take your body mass index and to calculate your weight in kilogram and your height in meter square. And then they have a table to show if you are overweight, underweight or normal. If you are less than 50, you are very severely underweight. If you are between 50 and 60, you are severely underweight. And if you are between 60 and 80.5, 80, uh, 80 you are underweight. And if your weight is, body mass index is 80.5 to 25, you are normal, healthy person. But if you are more than 25, you are obese. Is that, is that really correct? No. Body mass index is not a correct way to understand your Fat body fat. If you want to know it better, and if you are not in a jungle where do you where, where don't you don't have any tape measure to calculate your waist and hip, don't use body mass index and don't rely on them. If any doctor tells you, tell them that is wrong, because body mass index should be correlated with age, sex. If you go and if you measure a, a professional athlete body mass index, you will find a very high body mass index because their muscles are more and not body fat. So don't rely on body mass index, go to body adiposity index. If you, are, if you have a tape measure, calculate your hip circumference and multiply it by height and you will find some of the definite uh, numbers to calculate your body adipose or fat. But the best way that I recommend to everyone to calculate it and to know your risk for the diabetes, for hypertension, for heart attack, for stroke, for any other complications, use the waist to hip ratio. How to calculate it? Don't forget the best way. If you, are a, if you have a measure, tape measure, calculate your waist, waist circumference and have your hip circumference and then calculate the ratio between them. If you are a male and this ratio is under 90, and if you are a female and this ratio is under 80, you are normal. If it's between 0 0.90 to 0 0.99 and 0 0.80 and 0 0.84, it's overweight. It's always dependent on sex, male or female. If, if you are Waist to hip ratio is more than 1 and more than 0 0.85 for female, you are obese. Don't forget that after normal you and overweight, you have to have a date, you have to do sports. But in obesity, you have to go to doctor and find a solution for your obesity. There's two types of obesity. There is, I have here, an apple shaped obesity, which is more fat in belly, that is more risky, because you have more uh, risks for cardiovascular disease, for heart attack, and for strokes. But if your body fat is distributed equally to all your body, then you have lesser, less risk for cardiovascular disease and stroke. Don't forget that measure your body fat more than your body muscles because your body muscle is good and your body fat is not good. Thank you very much for watching my video. Goodbye.